This tutorial will show how to set a channel in order to start streaming. When started for the first time, the software will show only a single channel. For adding new channels, you must go to Channels menu and check Channel Options. Each of the channels can be added or subtracted by checking or unchecking the corresponding option. Each channel displays the type of the license available. In order to be able to work with a channel, you need to assign an input card and configure it. The preview will display accordingly, only after configuring the channel and feed it with signal. For assigning a card and perform the necessary settings, click on the input button. In the input dialog, you can select the desired card, the type of the connection and the video mode by choosing it from the corresponding drop-down list. The settings are applied immediately after selection. The video mode drop-down list allows you to select the video mode. There is an auto-detect mode, but we recommend assigning the video mode manually. The auto-detection may take up to 30 seconds, depending of the driver and the hardware. For SD signals, you have the option to choose between 4 to 3 and 16 to 9 aspect ratio. After configuring the input, the channel mini preview should display the incoming video. If there are problems with video mode or with the selected type of connection, the mini preview will display no video input. The installer supplies a preset for the first channel in order to simplify the streaming operation when started for the first time. Later you can edit it, or make other presets, that are more suitable to your needs. The streaming can be started by pressing the start button. Once the streaming process has started, the label of the button will show stop. For stopping the streaming, you need to press the same button. In the next tutorial we will explain how to make a preset.